Okay, for the next one here, we uh, go through the steps. We'll go through all the steps this time, I think. Uh, and so we separate half equations out. Now, uh, that's going from 0 to plus 2, so that's an increase. So I know that one's the oxidation one. So let's just start with that one. Uh, you need to write the oxidation states in, but I'm just going to leave them out. Uh, and we go to Zn2 plus. So the atoms are balanced out. Uh, the next thing I need to do is balance out the electrons, so the electrons can't just disappear. So I've got to write them in. So there's there's two electrons in there uh, coming out of that, so make the two plus. All right, now I need to, uh, uh, that's balancing the electron oxy from the oxidation states. Uh, so I've just jumped and gone a little bit lazy on that one, so I'll just strike that in. So that must be a plus two. Uh, so balancing the electrons based on the oxidation states, you add the 2 there, so 2 minus plus 2 gives 0. All right, I've just got it sort of jumped, so I'll go back there and do that again, sorry. All right, uh, and then the next step here uh, is to balance out the charge. Uh, that's 0 and that's 0, so we can skip that, so we don't need to add the H pluses and the H2O, so we're done. Okay, so let's go to the next one, which is going to be a lot more difficult. I was lucky enough to have done this one in class, so I know some questions to answer already. Uh, so the, the question is, well, do I add the H pluses and the NOs? Um, yes, because the O's are coming off. Yes, because it's aqueous. Yes, because it's an acid, and acids uh, in this situation can only act, uh, and in most situations, and it was the previous, one of the older definitions, that acids only react with water. Uh, I think that one of the definitions, the incorrect definitions, was it was it had something to do with the water as well, um, and so you need to draw the water in there for those three reasons, uh, and you've separated it out, so you've already removed these bits, uh, and so the other bits have to go into the next bit. Okay, uh, so that's the reason for it. Okay, so we start with balancing out the atoms of the oxidation species, which is the nitrogen, and that's done for us. So we can that, that's done. So now we just balance out the electrons. And so this is always minus two, except for hydrogen peroxide, which is the exception, which would be on the test because they only care about tricking you. Uh, and so you're only gonna get the exception. So this needs to be plus five. Uh, and so we've got plus five there. And that's minus two again. Oh, sorry, that's minus two. So that's a, there's two of those. So that's a total of minus four. Uh, and so there's no charge, you need a plus four. So that's a plus four, so that, that agrees. It's gone from plus five to plus four, so that's reduced. If you don't know how to do that, go back to the main video. And so we've balanced out the equations. So we need to balance out the electrons. Uh, and so that's reduced by one. Uh, and so we need to, I'll stick to the purple. Uh, we need to add, I'll put it over here because it's more relevant. Uh, there's a five to a four. Uh, so we need to add one electron uh, for that. Uh, so that's uh, so that's those oxidation species are balanced. Okay, the next thing out, the last one is balanced charge with H plus. Uh, and so, what do we have here? Uh, there's nothing here, so that's a nice neutral charge. Look at it, there's two neutral. Uh, there's a minus there and a minus there and a plus there. So there's a total of minus one there. Uh, so let's just add another H plus over here, and that gets us to zero. All right, and so that's balanced out of that there. Now we need to balance out the hydrogens, and we can see there's two there and two there, and there's three there and there's three there, so that's balanced out too. These are gradually gonna get harder and harder. I'll have to actually do these steps in the following ones. And so, that's a nice color to finish on. Let's go for orange. Um, and so we're now, we can balance, we're now we can add them back together, and oh, there's only one electron. So let's get rid of the electrons. Uh, that we're just using Hess's law now, and so we're just uh, times in everything by two. Uh, that allow us to cancel these bits out and write the final thing, which is zinc. Use the oxi use the states, uh, put the states that were up here back in there. I'm just going to leave them out uh, for simplicity here. Uh, plus four H pluses gives uh, what's over there, zinc 2 plus, plus 2 NO2, plus 2 H2O. Uh, and that's the second one balanced out.